You see them in parks in most big cities. People exercising and meditating to the teachings of Falun Gong. Practitioners say it heals body and mind. Well, you've probably heard of Falun Gong as a persecuted spiritual movement, and it really is. The Chinese Communist Party has done terrible things to it. But you probably haven't heard that Falun Gong has also become one of the most determined backers of Donald Trump. In recent years, it's morphed from being a fringe quasi-religion to being a big player in America's conservative media establishment. So what is going on at Falun Gong? In this joint investigation with ABC Radio's background briefing, we're taking you around the world to find out. We just want to ask you if Master Lee is here. In New York State, we'll visit the base of its reclusive leader, Master Lee, a former government clerk who believes aliens walk the earth. They see him as a, as a god, you know, they see him as the creator of the universe. We'll hear from a former follower who blames him for ruining her life. It tore my family apart. In Sydney, we'll meet a woman who believes Falun Gong's aversion to modern medicine caused her mother's death. If they get them in long enough, they're gone. I didn't realise how far down the rabbit hole mum was. And we'll investigate how media outlets set up by Falun Gong practitioners have spent millions to bolster Donald Trump. Over the last two and a half years, we've been reporting on the Trump administration honestly and without any false narratives. 